What up, what up, it's Chad Wildclay, and in my last Ninja Weapons video, a ton of you guys commented below to do Batman weapons. Holy cow, there were so many of you. So, let's go buy some Batman gadgets and test them out on some fruit and soda. And the first weapon we have got to test out is the Batarang. It has got to be one of Batman's most popular weapons. We see it being used in nearly every Batman movie and Batman TV show. Got to check out Karate Mart, of course, because they always have every ninja weapon I need. And of course, they do have the Steel Blue Bat Throwers for $14.95. If you are into bat-themed weapons, then the Steel Blue Bat Throwers should be number one on your list. Oh, these are cool. Bat Wing Bat Throwers. Three bat-shaped throwing stars for your nighttime adventures. All right, well, let's buy these and let's go have some daytime adventures. And the Batarangs have arrived. Let's check these babies out. Okay, it comes with a nice little pouch here and little straps. I can put this on my belt and I can open it up and pull out my Batarangs. Looks like there's three little pockets. Nice, look at this. Ooh, that is sharp. I just like poked my hand right here. I was opening this up, ow! Yeah, these will definitely do an amazing job. Got like razor sharp edges right here. This is really nice, check this out. It's like a brushed chrome, but a really dark, shiny blue stainless steel. Nice. Let's open up the other box. And here's the blue wing, just blue wing bat throwers. Here it is. Nice. I like that blue uh, design on there. That's cool. They're both about the same width. Both of these have very sharp edges here. Both are going to do an amazing job of destroying some emoji water balloons. That'll be fun. But before I do that, I need to become Batman. I think I found the holy grail of costumes here. This is HalloweenCostumes.com. And I found the Adult Deluxe Dark Knight Batman costume. I'm going to look exactly like Batman in this outfit. I am going to upgrade with a deluxe Batman mask. Let's order both of these things right now. Doo -doo -doo! And the Batman costume has arrived. Let's check this out. And the Batman deluxe mask. First, let's check out the mask. Why not? This is like a very thick rubber, but very kind of stretchy too. A couple Velcro straps in the back. And here's the deluxe Dark Knight Batman costume. And it looks really sweet. It's got like, like a hard chest plate here for me. Very, very lightweight, but it's gonna give me a very muscular look. Really cool kind of texture, stretchy material down here below for the legs. And it came with uh, a cape and a belt, right? In here. I am Batman. <sighs> All right, I got my buddy Justin behind the camera. What do you think are Batman's number one most used weapons? Uh, the Bat Boomerang. You got it. Yeah. Check that baby out. Woo! Yeah. Raise your sharp edges. So I've got these blue batarangs, just like throwing ninja stars. And I've got the black ones. Nice. What? Why don't we set up some enemies and knock them out, huh? Nice. The Joker doesn't stand a chance against Batman's batarang. Uh oh. All right, let's get these Jokers. Was the, that was my blue one. We're gonna use the black one this time. Oh! The Joker's got a strong face, huh? I think I need Catwoman's help. Let's go get her. And the next Batman weapon we will be testing out is not the thumbs up. Although if you do want to hit the thumbs up down below underneath this video, I would greatly appreciate that. That lets me know that you guys want me to continue doing these weapons videos. So thanks for hitting the thumbs up. But for real, the next weapon is Catwoman's Whip. Catwoman wields the bull whip. She uses it to whip and attack her opponents. Don't hurt us, lady. Our take home's less than 300. You're overpaid. <laughs> But she can also use it as a grappling hook to grab objects or ledges, and then she can swing from them. 
So let's jump online and see if we can find a Catwoman bullwhip. Here we go, this is perfect. Leather Bowl Whip, only $5.95, nice. If you're looking for a good quality whip made from genuine leather, look no further than the Leather Bowl Whip. The black braiding of this whip and its studded handle make for an intense whipping experience. All right, let's buy this thing. Dun, dun, dun. Let's check this thing out. Oh, wow, okay, so it's got a very sturdy handle here starts out thick then goes down thinner and thinner and thinner how long is this thing this is probably my goodness 10 feet long and then it comes to the very tail here it's got a little red string i guess so i've actually never used a whip before this is going to be very interesting but wait a second batman doesn't use a whip that's catwoman's job Huh, who could we have play Catwoman? I think I have an idea, but first, back to HalloweenCostumes.com. We've got the Girls Deluxe Catwoman costume. Yes, V is so small, she's gonna wear a girl's costume that will work just great for her, $39.99. Doo -doo -doo! The Catwoman costume has arrived. Check this baby out. You know what? I can't put this thing on myself, can I? No, I won't fit into this. Why don't we just get V into this thing and see how it looks? Where's Catwoman at? Oh! Hubba hubba! Damn, girl! You looking good! Wait, I don't sound like Batman, do I? No. Damn, girl! Batman sounds like that. Damn, girl! Much you better. You're looking good in that Catwoman outfit. No. <laughs> I know. <laughs> All right, so do you know what Catwoman's weapon is? A whip. The whip. Let's go get the whip. Here you go, Catwoman. Ooh. Don't whip me. I'm not into that S&M stuff. Right. And I, I'm, I'm going to take this off because I can't breathe. Oh, I should take this off too. All right, you can take yours off. Yeah. Once the whip comes out, just G-roll it. Oh, no. yeah. <laughs> Cut that out. <laughs> no, that's pretty funny. Nope, I'm keeping it. Whip it. Whip it good. Whip it good. Whoa! Oh my god, what the fuck? What you gotta do is you gotta crack the whip. Oh, you hear that? Ooh. Someone's gonna lose an eye. Yeah, don't hit yourself in the face. What do you think we could destroy with this whip? Maybe uh, maybe a water balloon. Ooh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Harder, faster. Batman turn. <laughs> These are some tough jokers. Let's try whipping it. <laughs> that looks so hard. <laughs> All right, these jokers are not gonna bust with the Catwoman's whip, so we're gonna have to go inside and get another weapon to beat these guys. If you guys wanna hang out with me before every video, make sure to go down below, turn on that bell symbol, cause I hang out with you guys during a live stream before most every upload, and I hang out with you in the comment section during the first 30 minutes of every upload. So make sure that bell symbol is not just black, but also black with the ringing bells on it. The next weapon we'll be testing out is Batman's gauntlets. Batman's gauntlets protect his arm between his wrist and his elbow and also serve as weapons because they have sharp edged spikes on them that dig into the sides of buildings, can block knives or sword attacks, and can be used as an offensive weapon against his enemies. So let's jump online and see if I can find some gauntlets for my arm. Here we go, combat arm gauntlets for $27.95. This set of two combat arm gauntlets features vinyl construction and a reinforced strip of three sharpened blades running along the outside of each forearm. This looks perfect. Let's buy these things. Gauntlets. Let's check these out, open these up. I've got two of them. 
wrapped in plastic. Ooh, these look nice. We've got the blades protected by some cardboard here. That's pretty smart. Get these cardboards off of there. Let's just take a look at one at a time here. Wow, these are cool. <laughs> Check those out. So those are the metal blades. This is gonna go on my arm. And it has uh, some straps here. And it also has uh, some metal plates here too. Like right here are metal plates to protect my arm uh, of sword attacks. So let's put one of these on my arm. Yes, got my gauntlets on. These are freaking cool, man. Check these out. I'm gonna be slicing through some fruit with these blades. And I'm gonna be blocking some sword attacks that come this way like this. So I got metal blocking mechanisms on here. Yeah, I'm digging these. These things look cool. Well, let's go outside and destroy some fruit. Now we have the Batman gauntlets. Hey, Catwoman, yeah. you wanna mess with me now with these metal gauntlets? You wanna, you wanna punch me with these metal gauntlets? Is on? it sharp? Pretty sharp. Just throw this red pepper at him. <sighs> <laughs> I can't see anything in this pass. <sighs> Catwoman's throwing the Joker at me. <laughs> that was too heavy for me. I can't. <laughs> The next Batman weapon we will be testing out is actually a weapon used by one of his greatest foes, the Joker, and his Joker cane sword. You often see the Joker walking with a walking stick or a walking cane, but that cane turns into a very sharp and deadly sword to attack Batman with. So let's jump online and see if we can find a cane that turns into a sword. Here we go, perfect. Traveler's Cane Sword for $29.99. This Traveler's Cane Sword is a great option for those that want a discreet yet practical self-defense system. By combining the walking stick, sword, and bludgeon weapon together, you can feel safe from camping, hiking, or simply strolling down the street. Oh yeah, this thing looks perfect. Let's get the Traveler's Cane Sword. And look what came in the mail today. I think we know what's gonna be in here. Let's just open it up and take a look. There we go. Yep, this definitely looks like a walking stick or a cane. Has a ball at the top here for grabbing with your hand. Has a little bit of a grip handle here. And then just a, a plain old metal cane with a rubber end down here. Nothing, uh, nothing to be concerned about, right? Just a plain old cane that uh, I can walk around with. But, wait, wait, wait a second. What is going on here? What is this? Oh, what the? That is a sword <laughs> inside of a cane. Look at this thing. Yeah, that is kind of sharp there, isn't it? Well, this is cool, man. Yeah, so you can be walking around with this. Nobody would know that you are just walking with a plain old sword inside of your walking stick. Let's put it back together so no one knows what we're doing when we're outside and let's go chop up some fruit. Hey Catwoman, did you know Batman walks with a cane? Is what? it when he, he retires or what? Yeah, when he retires <laughs> and he's old. No, actually this is Joker's weapon right here. The walking, oh, it is. The walking cane. What do you do with this? Yeah, you, you walk with it and it's a cane. That's, that's his weapon. I feel like it does something else. All right, let's I see. I just don't trust you, Chad. Let, let's see. Let's see if it does. So, let's see if it does something else. Our little silver things here. You just press in like so, and then you just pull it out like so, oh. and it is a sword. How sharp is it? Let's see. Oh, I thought she'd scream or flinch or something. Her? No. I don't. Yeah, I'm sure you could probably sharpen it. It's kind of sharp at the top. Definitely hurt somebody, but uh, definitely yeah. hurt some fruit. Definitely hurt some fruit. Oh. Hey, I just realized that the bottom of the cane can be a blocker. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, cool. Now, now, guys. 
Don't Those aren't curious. foam. That's true. And you can use the bottom as like a, a bludgeon, if you will. What's that bludgeon? So, so that's like something that you hit with, like a hammer. So you could go boom, like that. But we're gonna use the sword, and I think we should try to destroy some fruit with this. And actually, I think we should try to destroy some soda with this. What do you think? All right. Let's destroy some soda. That was cool! Flew around like a rocket ship. Woo! <laughs> All right, let's go back inside. And the next weapon we will be testing out is the weapon of a friend of Batman, Nightwing, and his Eskrema sticks. They are a pair of specialized batons wired with tasers, which made them electrified and are used for most of Nightwing's combat. Now, I'm not going to bother with buying any electrified Eskrema sticks because electricity is not going to really do much against fruit, but I am going to buy Eskrema sticks that have a little extra special feature in them. So let's go take a look. Oh yeah, here we go. The expandable metal grip baton, 26 inches for $21.95. So these are going to start out small and then expand into a larger baton. These are gonna be really cool to use. Now, before I buy these, I also, well, I'm gonna buy them, but I'm also gonna buy something to practice with because I don't wanna get injured practicing with these things. So I'm gonna buy some foam Eskrema sticks. And these are only $9.95. So we get a pair of these and these are going to be a foam rubber. So if we hit ourselves, no big deal. We will be safe. So let's buy both of these weapons. Dun, dun, dun. First we have the foam Eskrema sticks. There we go. These things are actually a lot bigger than I thought they would be. Uh, they got a cool golden dragon printed on them here. And look how big these are. And they're made out of foam. So if you hit yourself, not a big deal. You're not going to get too hurt. Great for practicing. Swing these babies around. Now, let's check out the real Eskrema sticks. Here are the real Eskrema sticks. Law enforcement, self-defense, and security. Let's check these out. Ho oh, ho. Look at that. That's This is pretty heavy duty. Cold metal. Uh, what's inside here? Oh yeah, we've got a, cool, a holder for this. So we put that right there, and this will go right on my belt. Very cool. All right, I got both my Eskrema sticks in their belt holder here. So if I'm out and about, and an enemy comes after me, I pull these out of my belt, and now with a flick of a wrist, these should expand. I've never tried this before. Let's give it a shot. <laughs> that was cool. Wow, these things are long too. Check out how long these are. Yeah, nothing's gonna hurt these things, but these things are gonna definitely hurt some fruit. So let's take these outside and give them a test. <sighs> hey, Catwoman, I got my Eskrema sticks here. You can have Eskrema, E S C R I M A. Now I can block your, your right. attacks with my uh, with my gauntlets here. Boom, boom. <laughs> that makes like a metal sound. Yeah. You hear that? They work really well. Like it doesn't even hurt. <laughs> <laughs> you looked so mad at me when I kicked you. Yeah. You're not supposed to kick. You're supposed to let me win. All right, now, so these are the practice Eskrema sticks. Okay. Let's go get the real Eskrema sticks. Now for the real Eskrema sticks, like Nightwing uses. I can pull them right out of my belt, just like so. Oh, oh no. they look so small, don't they? Oh. Pretty cool, huh? I gotta be careful with these. These are hard metal. Ooh. These will definitely destroy some fruit and other things. Pretty heavy, yeah. Yeah. Now I can block with my metal gauntlets. Oh, yeah, you hear that? <laughs> Jeez. Check this out, I can actually like hook it with my gauntlet right here, and I can disarm you. <laughs> now I got it for myself, woo! -hoo. Woo! Bring it on, Catwoman. Bring it. Ah! I'm not she got me in the face. I'm sorry. 
I just closed my eyes and I was like, I was just like, check. You're closing your, closing your eyes and going like this. Maybe stick to the foam for this one, guys. Yeah, I think so. So, what can we destroy with this? Uh, definitely some fruit. Everything. Some watermelon. Let's go destroy some stuff. Get ready to die, watermelon joker. Watermelon doesn't stand a chance against these scream of sticks. Look at this. That was right in half. Pretty perfect. Just because it's so fun to have them come out. I'm gonna put them back in. It's just too much fun to whip it out, huh? <laughs> If you guys want any of the weapons or any of the costumes used in this video, check out the links down below to where to get those. The costumes I got from HalloweenCostumes.com. Thank you so much, you guys. You have awesome costumes. Definitely gonna be using them a lot more in future videos. And of course, thanks to KarateMart.com for providing the weapons like they always do. If you guys want to use a 10% off coupon code on their website, type in Wild Clay during checkout and receive 10% off your order. So down below, links to everything that I used in the video. Please give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't seen this video here, definitely check it out. If you're not subscribed, check out this right here. Thank you V for helping out on this video. She has an awesome channel of her own. Check this video out because it's amazing. And I'll see you guys real soon with a brand new video. And comment below what you wanna see me do next.